We begin with new details in the police shootout caught on camera. Police in East Flatbush, Brooklyn, opened fire, killing a man who they say was chasing two other people down the street and shooting at them. Police just provided an update a short time ago and said the man who was killed may have been thought he was being mugged before he started chasing after the two suspected robbers. Let's get right out to Eyewitness News reporter Safan Kim. He's live in East Flatbush with these new developments. Safan. Well, Lauren and David, it was just before 6 o'clock last night when gunfire erupted down this street. More than a dozen shots fired in all. Cops say a gunman was shooting at two people. Officers exchanged fire. That's their patrol car riddled with bullet holes. And now today, we have new video capturing the chaos. It is a frantic chase caught on camera, followed by a police shootout. In this heart-stopping video obtained by Eyewitness News, you can hear six shots go off as police pull up in an unmarked cruiser in pursuit of a gunman chasing and shooting at a man and woman in the street. As four officers jumped out of their patrol car, cops say about a dozen more shots were fired. Police say that suspect fired several times at them. This is their patrol car struck by gunfire. You see New York City police officers running towards danger, running in the middle of gunfire, Stopping the threat. The 20 year old suspect was shot several times by police, pronounced dead at Kings County Hospital. He had no prior arrest. Cops say this is his firearm recovered at the scene. It happened in Brooklyn near the corner of Remsen Avenue and East 57th Street. The officers had canvassed the area for seven minutes when they came upon the suspect after they were flooded with 911 calls. We just kept going because we thought it was firecrackers. Yeah. Now back here live, meanwhile, a 60-year-old man, an innocent bystander, was shot once in the stomach. It's unclear who shot him, but he's expected to be okay. Detectives are investigating whether the gunman was chasing two people who tried to rob him. They le later learned that one of those two, a 19-year-old man, was wanted for mugging a 17-year-old in Brooklyn last month. Charges are now pending against that 19-year-old.